Hi everyone and welcome back to my more important analysis videos on Monday the 11th of December. Let's look at Euro dollar which has started to sort of again give another mixed signal really. I mean just looking on the me medium term analysis you sort of see a, just a, a whole catalogue of broken trends really isn't it. You've seen the broken trend that we had of about two months that's now been broken to the upside. That sort of building uptrend that was sort of four weeks on broke to the downside and then subsequently this small trend has now been broken by today's rally. So a lot of broken trends going on which would suggest that you're not really able to gain too much traction either way really on euro dollar um, and uh, yeah you've just started to turn a corner again. Um, interesting that this is this low that we saw on Friday came at um, 17.30 which is around about that 38.2% fib level interestingly enough and um, yeah the market has just picked up again that's sort of around about the support not a million miles off it of that 1712 level of that sort of reaction low that we saw later in November but uh, yeah, again the mo momentum indicators are beginning to turn around again this is coming wet as the mo moving averages are but sort of flattening as well moving averages and momentum sort of just beginning to settle down and MACD lines flattening off the RSI about 50 the stochastics sort of picking up again slightly or at least bottoming and it sort of all reflects a fairly mixed outlook really on euro dollar on a technical basis um, as you can see here on the hourly chart we've improved the outlook you need to now sort of get a move above 18.15 initially and then there's sort of another resistance around 18.50 area 18.40, 18.50 which is a bit of a pivot so um, yeah it, uh, it has improved the outlook this uh, move that we've seen today um, can it sustainably recover though um, would be the question I mean the, the, there is now a positive bias in the momentum as this trend has com has started to turn round and uh, you can see that in the hourly RSI which is sort of moving to a moving to 70, MACD lines above neutral, stochastics positively configured on the hourly. So that would suggest near term buying into weakness. Um, you look at sort of 1775, 1750 area, 1760 as your sort of basis of support. 1730 as I said was Friday's low. So yeah the market has sort of turned a little bit of a corner so 33 pips up on the day. Um, it needs to now start to build a run of positive candles um, at and um, that would start to sort of see the market swinging back higher again. Um, but it's interesting that this uh, move has come as the momentum indicators have just started to bottom out. So I wish you good luck in your trading today and I'll speak to you later.